guys, it is me, Siri Tsaru, and I'm back with another bad fan fiction reading of the Forgotten Weasley. So today's chapters are The World and the Baby. Alright, so we are getting here. <coughs> Alright, here it is, The World. The travel back to the UK. I look at the flat world. Yes, the world is flat. <laughs> Oh my god, you- Okay, she really just threw in the whole, like, the earth is flat sort of thing. And there's gotta be people that are gonna be flapping back and forth. Because, yes, this is a pretty controversial debate on, like, you know, whether the earth is round or if the earth is flat. It's- it's a very heavy debate. And personally, I ain't got any says on that because I personally- think it's it's just you know why are people even debating about this like it shouldn't even be debated about okay let, let your opinion just stay where it stands and we can all be happy and just not around there are many people around the globe that believe the world is flat and i am one of them i run to the bathroom and throw up i'm so sick what does that have to do with the earth being flat <laughs> think she's 11. <laughs> the only thing I can think of that is that I'm going to have a baby. I take a test and I look at the stick. I am pregnant. Did you even have a period, girl? I'm sorry, but what the actual, what? What is happening? What? <laughs> People, and, okay, I'm pretty, I mean, there might be, there are a lot of people, um, <laughs> but yay, I'm so enlightened. Excuse the sarcasm. <clears throat> but honestly, like, stop, 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 stop. There are people who actually think, I'm, I'm pretty sure there's, there are people throwing in theories that maybe this chick is 11. This is a short chapter, but I will update later. I love you. Yeah, thanks for that. Okay, so next chapter, the baby. Author's note. So the last chapter was so short because I was at school. So here's part two. You're welcome. Or you know what you could have done? You could have taken time, you know. Just look over the story and stuff and... I mean, I've had... I mean, I'm not gonna lie. I've been kind of guilty of making some of those filler type chapters but i at least try to you know make it seem decent and not look like crap okay i am in uk now and i don't know what uh what do tell draco saf come to my office dumbledore okay i say i know you're hiding something he say i'm not okay i'm pregnant okay what are you gonna do do Draco know? He doesn't. I'm pretty sure he doesn't. <laughs> but I don't even think this chick even had her period or chiz. Like, she's 11. Like, I thought she was 11. I don't get it, y'all. I don't. I don't freaking get it. I, I really don't. I... Th Ugh. This, I don't even know. <laughs> no, I cry. Dumbledore pat my back, comforting me. Tell him. I can't. He will hate me. I dare you to. Double dog dare you. I have to do it now. He double dog dare me. More like you will, you will bump it up to. I triple dog dare you. Okay. Deco. <laughs> Deco. <laughs> I have to tell you something. I'm pregnant, I say. Oh, okay, he say. What do we do? You're 12 and I'm 14. We can't be parents. We can't be parents. Okay, I know what to do, I say. I thought she was 11! <laughs> what is this? <laughs> oh my goodness. <laughs> I guess, did Draco never, I guess some people might have guessed, oh gosh, did he, okay, first you do the double dog, you do double dog there, and then you ain't ever heard of a condom, 
goodness gracious. Hello, I need an abortion. I say, come with me, a lady in a doctor's coat say. Okay, we're about to have some crazy chiz going on. And this is where people are going to get heavy debatable. And I don't want that out going on. You know, the whole thing about abortion and stuff. Um, and I know you guys are probably me wondering what the heck. What? Okay, all right, Emma G, what's your What's your own take on this? Personally... I think it should still be legal because, because I mean, there are medical because, you know, people do it for various reasons besides just doing it just to do it. People, I mean, I mean, there might be some medical issues or it just might be some other reasons or if, and, you know, I mean, it's like, gosh, it's like, you know, so many crazy things, I mean. I mean, like I said, the medical, you know, having, you know, when you have medical issues, that's, like, probably one of the biggest reasons why I... Th but still, it should I, it should be illegal. Okay, that's all I'm going to say. I don't want to go on any more about this because the last thing I'm going to get... The last thing I need is people arguing and chis back and forth and, well, I don't want that here. Okay. She taken me to a room with a bed thingy and an ultrasound machine. She checked to see if I'm pregnant. Seth, you're not pregnant, she say. That was embarrassing. Why is she laughing at me? Next thing I know, I pull out my wand and scream, I found a cadabra! <laughs> cadabra! And she died. Oops. No! <laughs> what is happening? <laughs> oh. oh my god! <laughs> <laughs> oh my god, okay, office, no. I'm not, I'm not too sure about the end. Qu uh, may, uh, why? Honestly, why? Question of the day, how tall are you? Uh, um, answer of the day, five foot six. Lord of mercy, oh my goodness! And I, I mentioned this before, but I'm five foot zero. Five feet, exact. I've been that height since I was like, what, fifth grade. And I'm 21. I'm a college student. Yep. Jeez, I'm going to look like a hobbit. <laughs> but I swear, I looked like, I'm pretty sure I looked like a freaking hobbit standing next to a bunch of tall people. Heck, I even looked like a freaking, like, almost like, low-key, like, kind of like a hobbit when I was standing next to Josh Turner that one time. Okay. <laughs> Yeah, you get the memo. I mean, I once stood next to Josh Turner, and yeah, I was really short. But anyway, hope you guys enjoyed that, and I will see you guys next time. Bye, guys! Anyway, oh, oh, sorry. Sorry, I forgot to tell you the next chapters. Okay, next thing, um... Okay, well, there's there are probably a few sections that say fan art, which I'm going to completely skip. So, next chapters will be... H... 8... And then pan a dill. Oh, and then also, there's a little explanation for something. Yeah. I don't know, flip it back and forth. But, I mean, it'll be up to pan and dill for the next chapters to be read. But anyway, hope you guys enjoy that, and I will see you guys next time. Bye, guys! Bye, guys.